what strategies have been put in place to penetrate the South African market and the African market as a whole? So from a Dean, country, from a dean South African point of view, we have established a partner program where we together with our partners work on a way forward in order to not only create demand from the experience side of our employees but also for our partners as establishment within things like the vendor lists within companies uh, presence in the southern and uh, you know African markets so it's going to be a hand wash the other scenario where we're going to support them from a knowledge transfer point of view technical backup and they will bring us the opportunities just due to their presence in the market what new opportunities is the company bringing to South Africa? A multiple. The first would be, as again stated earlier, the knowledge transfer from a company that has got over 100 years of experience with enlightening and search protection. We would share this via seminars, uh, time spent with end users, training, also training up our, our own staff. Uh, we might also bring in manufacturing in the future, could be a very big possibility for us. With that comes job creation. With the job creation, obviously, then we also add to the market itself. And that's really what we could bring from an opportunity point of view. Also, a lot of funds are being transferred into this country, are being invested here from, the, from, from Germany. And that's also something that would you know, make our country benefit from this. What makes Dean unique to the other companies that are already established in South Africa? The company Dean is uh, more than 100 years old, has more than 100 years of experience. We are a family owned uh, company, we are not belonging to the stock market, so we can have a very uh, long term oriented strategy and uh, we are have a lot of patents and uh, a lot of technicians and that is unique to other companies. What led to the decision to come to South Africa? Dane has a clear strategy to go uh, to other countries to inter internationalize uh, the company uh, and as we have in the European community a slightly downturn in growth we are concentrating since several years on other countries especially the BRIC countries and when you're looking on the BRIC countries you see very fast uh, the potential of South Africa the long-term potential of South Africa and that's why we decided to uh, invest here 